is uh, good morning, y'all. I'm out here just wanted to give you a quick look into what we do. So, I'm over here parked like this. Doing the delivery, got to walk it over here, go up the ramp, make a left, and go to their kitchen. They hooked it up with a little juice. Let's take a look inside. I just finished it, but just so you can take a look at how the trailer's looking so far. I'm in a 28, it's a pub. Going up the ramp, no lift gate. So look, when you have something like this, see I, I took out this piece of the pallet. Like, you, know, you know, I'm over here sweating, it's a physical job. But these right here, they're glass. So when you take apart, you know, everything's off pallets and wrapped just like that, they're wrapped. And now it's strapped. This one wasn't strapped, but it was wrapped. I cut the wrap, took out what I needed to take out for this stop. But since this is glass, I gotta, you know, downstack it, put it on the floor. Because if I'm driving and that thing falls open and it breaks, then that's the case I'm not gonna deliver. That's the case I'm not gonna get paid for. And there's a mess on my truck with glass all over the place now. Now I gotta be more careful. So it's always better, you know, grab it, put it on the floor. Even if it's something that's not gonna break, it's always better safe to sorry, just put everything on the floor. If you see like a little tower that's too high, you know, under that it's plates. And then, but these two on top right here, it's glass. If the rice falls over, it's not a big deal. And with, with how heavy it is, I don't really think it's gonna fall over. But I'm gonna go ahead and put that down. Uh, this stop only had 30 cases. Today's a light day, eight stops, 380 cases. You know, weren't for Gordon. Uh, so I'm like, you know what? I'm not gonna kill myself today. I'm gonna take it easy. Maybe get a little bit more hours since I'm, you know, I'm taking it slow. I got a few stops that I have to walk a lot. So remember out here in full service, I'm gonna say, don't kill yourself too much. Because when you finish the day, guess what? The next day you're gonna come back and hop on another truck and empty out another trailer. So I say just take it one day at a time, take it easy. I know you wanna get home early, but just don't kill yourself. You know, Gordon is one of those ones that they don't throw you out there with too many cases. You usually average between nine, 10 stops and 500 cases more or less. That's an average, you know, today I'm eight stops, 380 cases, like I said. Uh, there's days you usually go with more, but there's typically the average, you know, nine, 10 stops, 500 cases. Uh, when I know there's spots that they leave with almost a thousand cases every day, uh, 15 stops a day, you know. Do you really want to do that? Yeah, the money's going to be there. The money's going to be there. But you're gonna get home, you're gonna get so tired and dead beat. I mean, if, if that's worth it for you, you wanna you know, bust your ass a little bit more, then go ahead if you want the money that bad. But I'd say you need a good balance between, you know, your job, your health, how physically tiring it is, and the money. You need a balance between both, you get me? I've already made a, a video about more, like the average amount of money that I was getting when I first started. If you wanna update on that, you guys just let me know. But yeah, uh, I just want to give you guys a quick little update on it. More or less how it's looking like, how the trailer looks like. You know, I never really show the inside of the trailer while I'm at work. I usually just talk about it at home after work. So I decided to switch it up a little bit today. If you guys have any questions, go ahead and leave it down in the comments. Uh, I'll try my best, you know, to answer them if you want. Maybe make a video uh, explaining into detail about certain things you guys want to explain. But other than that, go ahead and enjoy my free iced tea that they gave me pick up the ramp and continue on to my next stop i'll talk to you guys